Hello everybody. This is Diane from Diane's Diamond Painting Journey. And how you all doing? I hope you're doing wonderful. And I want to say hi to my subscribers, old and new. Thanks for being here. Really appreciate it. And if you're new here and it's the first video that you've seen of mine, well, hello, welcome. I hope you like it enough to, uh, oh, cat hair. Hope you like it. <laughs> Hope you like it enough to stay. Oh yeah, so I just get off track all the time. That's normal. And uh, you guys can all like whoever likes the video can even if you're not subscribed, you can hit that like button and leave me a comment. I love hearing your comments and answering you back, of course. And if you're new, you can hit that subscribe button if you really like what you see, which is an unboxing today. The funny way, the new way, the new way I'm doing unboxings. So this is from Diamond Art Club. Most of mine are from Diamond Art Club, but I do try to buy from some other uh, places too. So what do we got for you today? Want me to show you? I'll just go right ahead and show you. We have Apple Dragon by Stanley Morrison. Oh my god. I already did. Oh my god, so pretty. This is the new round canvas. So I had done an unboxing just a little while ago of uh, Autumn Path. I'll try to remember to stick that up in the eye just so you can see the difference. Um, and like you, you couldn't pick the picture out so well. That's what rounds are known for. But their new rendering of rounds is just as good as squares because you can see this picture just like you don't even need to don't even need to do anything with it. And the I'll show you after though. But the, the guide circles are extremely light. Yay! Because me with the bad eyesight, no matter how careful I am with placement of drills, I will always see a guide circle on rounds, which this is a round. Oh my God, he looks so cute. It's like, here's the outside of the apple and here's the inside of the apple. <laughs> we got a little ladybug. Not sure what that is there. Might see it better in the picture. We got some flowers and some vines and a bunch of tree branches down here. So he's up in the trees. Looks like the moon is up here. We got a lot of, uh, could be tedious stuff in the background to do. I don't think it's all one color either. Uh, I might cut the top off because I'm not sure you need all of this up here. Yes, I would cut the top off if I want to. The canvas will still hold together because when I put them up on the wall, all I do is uh, put washi tape around them, around the edges, and I cut off what's left over. And I uh, thumbtack it to the top of the wall, use thumbtacks for the top, and poster putty on the back, or white tack, whatever you want to call it, blue tack, all the same thing. Mm, same stuff you put in your pen. Yep. It was originally made to hang posters. Ha ha ha. So, this one is Apple Dragon is 51 by 66 centimeters. Stanley Morrison slash Tate Licensing. So, that means Stanley is getting paid for his artwork from Diamond Art Club. And they only sell licensed artwork. My God, this is gorgeous. That looks like apple seeds, don't it? Like a little apple seeds in the middle. He's so cute. And there's his claws. Little legs. Yeah. Oh my God, I love his dragons. And I have uh, his mystery kit that he put out too. Now he did a mushroom dragon. I don't have that one yet. But anyway, you can't have everything, can you? <laughs> we try, so don't we? Us diamond painters. So you got a legend on the top left, bottom right. You got, this is poured glue. So I can do this to it. Do what makes you sparkle, Diamond Art Club. But to tell you the truth, it came out of the box pretty much like this. I'm going to zoom in now. We're near that background. And let's see what we're in for. See the sparkle on the canvas? The canvas is very soft on the back, too. 
So it's not. Um, there will be color blocking, like over here, and over here, and all down through here. Oh dear lord. And then we're into the moon. And we just got Miss Molly came up on the table. Hang on, I zoom out. Yep, that's Miss Molly. Let's see. Molly, say hi to the peoples. Nope, Mom, I can't. Uh, hello. <laughs> me thinks me might have to stop and move my cat. Hang on one second, please. Oh, wait, now she's going, no, no. We'll see what we can we can do. We'll see. We'll see. We'll lay it on Molly and see what happens. There we go. That's one way to get rid of her. She's jumping to the couch. <laughs> there you go. That's Miss Molly, my cat I brought from Canada with me when I moved to Belgium. She's not very happy right now. Uh oh. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> oh, I think this is adorable. I like dragons, but I don't like those scary dragons. I have one scary dragon upstairs, but other than that, I'm a Randall Spangler fan and I've become a Stanley Morrison fan. Two different kinds of dragons, though. So. Yeah, yep, 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 yep. So let's do this first. You'll still see all the things, you just see it in a different way. So you have a small sticker that's like the sticker on the box or the label on the box. And, um, you can put this on the end of the box or the side of the box, whichever way you store your kits and would you can then see the sticker to um, be able to find them easier, which I never did. And so, yeah, it makes it harder for me. <laughs> so now I just put mine in a little book with all DAC stickers. Yeah, crazy like that. So then we have the big sticker sheet. All of this sheet is a sticker. So I cut this down here, cut this off, and all this big sheet here I put in my log book. You got your start and end date, name, name, round, uh, how big it is, you got your SKU number, R for round, ABs, you know there's ABs. And there are 58 colors in this baby. What's it, 51 by 66, whoa. We're gonna do some color change in summer. Look at the baby. Oh my God. Isn't that gorgeous? And I guess that's apple blossoms. Oh, duh. Yeah. <laughs> Sometimes this old brain is slow. <coughs> Hang on one second. Now I take a sip of my drink. <sighs> the talking. So we have four ABs. How do I know that? With Diamond Air Club. Anything below the number 150 it will be ABs. So we got, could be two greenish looking ones, a red one, and a white one. Four, yeah, obviously he's white. So let's just look at the symbols. And I like this. See, it's a white one. Now, this one's green and it's got a black on it. That's not bad. So I think they're listening. We're going to have some nice colors. These symbols look good. Now, like, I mean, good as in not confusing. Jeez, I call that, um, what was that old video game? I forget. Somebody tell me. And these are pre-cut stickers. I'll show you now. We've got a few extras here. Look. So you can just take them and put them on your baggie, if you use baggies, or on your containers like I do. So, let's have a look at the drills. No, I won't call them all out, but I'll stop at the ABs, which we got one right now. We have a green, like a pea green. So you see that like shiny coating on top, that rainbowish type coating? So that's what they call the Aurora Borealis coating. So it makes it shine even more. These are the little, they're in little bags. Here we go. We got static. We got static. Yep. There's no holes in the bags. If you see holes in the bags, there's usually not static. 
Peach yellows and peachy pinks. Some kind of khaki, navy green. And the wine family, maybe. That's like a burgundy, a deep wine color. So why was that when we said, uh, let's see, 100, so like a different kind of green. We have a short strip, the beige is brown and red. Now see, there's, see the hole in that bag? And there's no static in that bag. Hmm. The nerves. Beige six. One oh three. One oh three is like a little orangey color. I don't think I've ever had this one before. With the A B coating. Got a party animal in with the reds. Must be looking. One thirty five is like oh it's like a lime green. Chartreuse they call it maybe. 135 is number three. We got browns and got some grays. Pink, gray, pink, green, brown, pink, pink. Brown, and I don't know how I found that, put that in here. Brown, some greens. And the big bags. Oh, that's the white. They have the best white I ABs of any people. I don't care what anybody says. You can really see the sparkle on them. Now, these bags got holes in them. I don't know what they're doing. So, these might not have so much static, these ones. Six. Page. More like a burgundy red. Deep red. Yeah, I got one bag of 310 and one bag of 3371, but that's brown. We have 842. Let's look. Equal sign. That's going in. That's going in the bottom in the in the the background. 814. Oh my god. We got 840, 648 is 648, hello, where are you? Is narrow, that's in the background. We got two bags of that one. And then we got four bags of 647, that's the A, that's going in the background. So we know the background is going to be this colors of gray, these beiges, and something else. All right. So we got static and non-static. There we go. Yeah, it is. Says no one. All right, let's see. Now, I did take a little peek at, uh, at the canvas just to see if I could find the ABs for you because I have troubles. So I did notice, okay, see the white sign, the flowers that line the flowers? That's all ABs. That's ABs there. Uh, white ones. We got a little bit of green. That was the pea green color, I think. No, that's not fours. Let me get the legend here. Doop, 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 boop, boop. Okay, so it's fours again. Fours here. There are some fours right here. That's all whites. And then in the body, like you got threes here, so that's like a little greeny color, green. And um, there's some fours. No, it's not four. No. Oh, there's some ones right here. So that was a greeny color, a lighter green color. And we got like dots of green here. Where did I see the twos? Oh, the twos. Okay, hang on. Like, there's little specks of two right here. Oh, where? 
here. Just dots of it going up through there. Let me see if there's any. And there's like dots of the two right here, like here, 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 here. So it's sprinkled pretty light. Um, and the face, we got some green AB right here. Four right in the middle of the eye, white. For, there wasn't a lot in the bags yet. You got some twos in the monks right here somewhere. Some two, 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 two. So it's very sprinkled in. There's not a lot of... Um, the biggest thing you're going to see is white AB. The, the, the orangey, reddy color and the two greens are going to be uh, very sparingly. Like there's some white, right? Oh, I know. If you could see what I'm not showing you. There's some uh, number ones here. That's one of the greens. Yeah. So it's going to be sparingly put in there. Yeah. The biggest thing is the white. Yeah, I figured it might have more red in it, more uh, red AB in it, but maybe there will when it's finished. Who knows? So let's take a look at the size. 51 by... So we're off by smidge, 51 by 61. No, 66, sorry. Yeah. Because if I had that flattened, it would be 66 on the button. And I believe my other one I did was Tea Dragon, uh, Teacup Dragon. It was a green dragon in a teacup. And that was squares. And it may be a little bit bigger. I'm not sure. So, if you store your uh, drills in a separate place, it says the SKU number here in Apple Dragon. And it did come in a Diamond Art Club sleeve. And you got your box. Rounds. I see here's your nice picture. Looks like your small sticker. Scan to get 10%. Massinia kit had a diamond paint. There you go. That's the box. And yes, I know you want to see the toolkit. <laughs> So we're not going to call these the new new two kits. Now these are the normal two kits. The other ones are the old ones. We'll call them old. Ooh, that's the first time I got a a purple pen. Might have to keep that one, although it's showing blue, but it's purple sparkly with the purple pen grip, which I can never get on when I'm on camera. No, boy, just forget it. We have. A four placer and a seven placer, which means you can put four or seven diamonds down the one time. That will go on the other end of your pen. And we have a bag of baggies for leftovers. There's not enough to kit up in. We have a white tray because the clear one they're getting rid of. Because the clear one, when people laid it down, say you say I was laying it down right here, and I was or right here, yeah. I was going to do these pink ones, and I had pink. In here, well, then I'm seeing the pink through the drill tray. There's words, and it, it, it just wasn't right. So, you got your little heart shaped container with two things of wax in it, and these trays come with a stopper, which I'm just gonna do this right now for now for a reason. Um, your two plates of wax have plastic on the bottom and the top. So, if you don't peel it back, you cannot get any wax out. How to load your pen? Just go straight down, do a little twist around. See that red dot? You got wax in your pen. If you want to do your multiplacer, go straight down. This is good for wax, not, not for putty. See, you got the red. You can now pick up four drills to one time. Yes, you can. And there are videos on YouTube how to do that. I could do one, I suppose, but maybe I will one day. Who knows? So then we have, I don't know what color that is. Oh, it's more navy blue, yeah, with arrows on it. And we have a little, a little kid on with a flower. And you say, what's that? That is a cover minder. And the cover monitor has magnets on the back, two magnets. 
So what you would do if you're gonna start painting down here, and you wanna hold back that plastic, take one magnet in this hand, go down below, it snaps together, and it will hold your plastic back. Simple as that. Now that you know what it is, right? Not simple if you don't know. There you go. So there you have it. Stanley Morrison's. Morrison? Yeah, I don't want to say your right name, right? Apple Dragon. And I just think she's adorable. And I hope you like what you saw. I'm just putting this in the bag here because he knows what I'm like, right? Yeah. I actually put all this stuff into recyclables. Except for the washi and the magnet. Because I hope someone will take it out and use it. I don't know what else to do with it. And uh, so, I hope you like what you saw. This should still be on the site, I think. I think. But if it is, go buy it because it's just so cute. Well, that's if dragons are your things. And uh, let's just see right quick, though. So, as a ladybug... And this just looks like a ring. I don't know what a ring of what, though. And you got his little feet here and here. Here and here. Oh, duh. This is his tail. Poop. But you don't see the end. Because I looked at it up close. I had to take my glasses off and look at it. Yep. Oh, and it's got his little claws on that branch there, too. And there's these other ones there, certainly. And his little baby spikes. Actually, it looks like the the thing in the apple that you twist off before you eat your apple. <laughs> Too cute. All right, I'm going to let you go. So bye for now. First, oh, give you a big squishy hug because everybody needs a hug. And I hope you like what you saw. Hit that like button. Leave me a comment. I keep forgetting to tell you that down in the description down below, there are some customer appreciation codes at three different places that I have codes for. So go down and have a look, and maybe you'll save yourself some money if you want to buy from one of those companies. And bye for now. Love you all.